playing for Triple G Gaming, we have Dream. There we go. Thought we were missing something. Bottom left corner in the red Zerg pieces for Kaizy Gaming, we have Solar. All right, a little bit of TVZ action here. Uh, last week, Dream and DRG has some of the most wild TVZ games. I believe it went all five matches. If I'm not mistaken, it w no, it may have gone all five. I can't remember. I just know Dream was involved in with some of the craziest games. Um, so I'm excited to see what he comes out with uh, this time around. Solar here is going for a hatch gas. Ooh, ooh, looks like he uh, dropped the hatch slightly off center. Had to cancel and reapply. Little bit of a uh, rough mistake there early on. It's going to cause, uh, you know, at, at, at these higher levels, uh, timing does matter. Oh, interesting route, Lisa. All right, pool goes down. Gas. So it goes hatch, pool, gas. So he goes pool before gas. Not sure what the rationale behind that there is. Reaper coming out first. Aldi, how's it going, my friend? Good to see you. All right, Reaper gonna come out here first. It's rallied right to this hatchery here. There goes the Reaper. Oh, just one of those days, eh? Kind of so-so. Alright, Reaper gonna come in here. We'll see the timing on the hatch. We'll uh, take a couple shots at that drone. Drone will get saved. Link's coming in here. Ooh, drone getting really low. Does uh, use a spore trick. Reaper also getting relatively low here. Gonna micro back the weakened links. Queen is about to pop. Once that queen pops, this uh, Reaper needs to GTFO ASAP. There we go. Queen pops. Gets out of there with five hit points. Back at home. It was the command center before factory. It is a 1-1-1 one, one, one opener. We are swapping over the uh, barracks and the factory. So pretty standard stuff here. Gonna go for those double Hellions. And just uh, macroing up. Uh, pretty standard uh, early game PVC from our Terran player. Zerg is wanting to spread creep. Third base is down. Queen gonna stay out here, keep the Reaper at bay. Second Queen is out. That Queen has a little bit of energy on it. Needs to drop down that creep. But wants to do it with the Reaper far away. Not able to uh, pick off that tumor. Double Hellions will show up here now. With this Reaper. Queen's doing a good job of keeping them zoned out. Gonna jump in here, try to get any damage. Uh, there's no drones here just yet. So the Hellion and Reapers, Reaper and Hellions, I should say, will get out of there. Link speed finishing on up here. And uh, Solar just continuing to drone up here. Getting more drones, saturating up uh, his third base now. He's going back onto gas there in the main base. How many queens does he have? He has five queens, getting one more. Back here, our uh, Terran Parrot player is going bio. Dropping down that engineering bay. Dropping down a couple more barracks. Getting stem. Gonna get a reactor down on that bear uh, on that uh, starport. Over here, these uh, Hellions, uh, just being annoying. There's actually quite a few Hellions here. There's about, let's take a look here. Six Hellions here. Uh, if these Hellions want, they can jump in and uh, potentially take out a lot of workers. Queen's doing a good job of zoning them out. Hellions gonna come in here, roast some of those links, keep them off at bay. 
Oh, exam period. How I don't miss that at all. The Viking coming in here. Taking out two overlords from the looks of it. Hellion's going to come in here, deny some creep. Plus one infantry attack starting on up here. Couple more barracks going down. So it looks like he's going to go up to five barracks. Combat shield starting up right now. Good creep clearing here from uh, Dream. Solar getting up there, trying to replant that creep. Going to rotate around here. Not going to dive in. All right, we have our first big push coming in here. This is going to hit just as combat shields and plus one attack finishes up. Uh, bailing speed just starting up now. There are nine banes being made here. Tanks are going to siege up behind this here. A uh, beautiful siege position for those tanks. Going to make it really hard to engage. The rocks were not broken down here. And uh, the Terran has a good foothold here. Second tank also taking some good shots. Those lings... Uh, Okay, going to jump in here, going to try to collapse on. A good flank from behind uh, will clean up one tank. Second tank doesn't go down. Those Hellions uh, doing, uh, putting in some work there, cleaning up the lanes that came from behind. A lot of these queens have also gone down here. Lanes are tricky, and GG gets called and Dream. Winning game number one with... Yeah, that plus one timing, um, I've died to it a few times myself. And I don't know if you guys are seeing this. There's SCVs on the map. While the first uh, supply depot is still being made. First barracks is coming down. Second barracks about to come down. Nope. Second barracks. Second, there you go. And uh, third barracks will be coming down relatively soon. So it'll be three proxy at uh, three barracks. I believe this will be Marines. Solar will not scout this. These uh, overlords definitely not on a scouting path. He did go hatch first. Solar with some really interesting uh, rallies here earlier on. Early on. Triple barracks about to finish up here. First barracks done. First marine coming on out. What do we have here? Nothing. You know why we have nothing? Because the pool is still about halfway through. Oh, Solar is kind of scouting with that second overlord, but he went to the wrong side of the map. And here we come. Just outside of Solar's vision. Okay, he must have seen that SCV. He does pull a... No, he was just rallying them in. All right. What's he going to do here? Going to pull all the boys. There we go. There we go. Going to have to make sure this bunker doesn't get up. There we go. Kills one SCV. Going to start focusing on that second SCV. Lings are out. One drone has gone down so far. Second SCV going down here. Trying to get us around on these... Uh, on these where he does get us around on a few of those. Five drones now going down. Both links getting cleaned up here. Now this bunker is so close to it. The queen is out. That queen was going to chase down that SCV. Six workers in total going down here for our Zerg player. This should be held, though. All right. Second queen going to come down here. Going to drop some creep to start clearing it. Going to go after this overlord. Overlord will sur uh, survive for now. Lynx. Uh, sorry. Marines continue to be made here. So, did he lose a queen there? 
Yeah, he lost one queen there. Second queen is getting really low. Gonna have to evacuate the drones from the low ground here. Losing a... Uh, losing a Overlord too. Luckily, he's not supply blocked. More workers going down here. 10 orders. Jesus. Dream with that Terran mint hand. I, I honestly think uh, Solar thought the push was done. Uh, with the barracks uh, going down and... Not the barracks, sorry. The bunker going down. Or getting cancelled and uh, no more SCVs. But Dream decided to just stick around and uh, continue to pump out those... Uh, Marines and just overwhelm. Like, I think there was even a point there where uh, Solar just started to uh, drone a little bit. And he may have just over droned. Uh, I think he did what he usually does pulls all the drones but three. Because it's vital that that bunker doesn't go up, and if it does, you know, body block the Marines out of it. Third base coming on down here. Where is that Reaper? The Reaper is kind of just chilling out here in the main base. I'm gonna do that Reaper Ling dance here. Ooh, nearly gets one there. Does not. Will Queen will pop? Force that Reaper back down. Pleasure should have you here, big homer. I'm actually surprised. Uh, ooh, we have a quick third base coming down here behind that factory. Actually, it's not that quick. Um, but it is. We're going to take a little bit of damage from that queen. It is just behind the third base of the Zerg. So what do we have on the map? We have one Reaper and one Marine. This is a little bit of a greedy play. I feel like if Solar knew this, he would have sent some wings over by now. But instead, he's going to play it a little safe and just macro up. Now, I'm surprised we haven't seen a 12 pool from Solar just yet. Now, I'll be totally honest with you guys here. There is a slight caster bias towards Solar. He is one of my favorite players. So, Game paused. Anyone that can read, that is what was said. All right, these Hellions just kind of hanging out here. Colm Eason, I really hope it's not a 3-0. I'm really hoping for uh, at least a game five or game four. Uh, I'll be happy with a game four. A reverse sweep would be nice. Link's going to come in here, get a full scout out of everything. Our forces are under attack. Well, Viking here going to... Try to take out an Overlord. How many kills does that Viking have? Viking has one kill on it. Helly is being kept at bay by the Queens. Ooh, guess that uh, Creep Tumor just in time. Queens will drive it away again before they drop down another Creep Tumor. And we have another link. Oh, that link is not going to get in. Third base will get scouted here by Solar. Just in case you didn't know it already existed. Gold base now being taken by Solar. And the standoff here between the Queens and the Hellions just kind of persists. 
So we're going to uh, break open some of these rocks, open up some of those pathways, make defending and attacking a little easier. <laughs> oh, I wish. After this game, I will probably run and grab something to drink. I just didn't have a lead up time I normally do. All right, we have the push coming in here. This time it is um, uh, Marine Mines. Mines are going to plate plant themselves. Lynx has to be careful of that. Some creep was uh, pushed back there. Tumors will get replanted. Look at that tumor go. And of course, just as the tumor's finished, the uh, scan comes in. That's a lot of Bane's gonna crash in there on top of those uh, hell bats. So they're trying to send in one link to set off those mines. Gonna jump in here, collapse on top of this again. Gonna pick up. Ooh, does get all the uh, mines though. Good pick up there. L Bane speed finishing up now. Fourth base now being taken for Dream. Also the gold base. Solar taking a fifth base here. And we have another push coming out here. Uh, supply cows relatively even. Uh, Solar does have a worker supply lead. Uh, Dream does have the army supply lead. Looks like these links are getting ready for a counter a, a flank attack from behind. Dream will head back home. Nope, he's gonna rotate around. Oh no, this is just a straight up counter attack going in, trying to get into the natural. Mines will burrow. I think the mines did more uh, uh, friendly fire than anything else. 16 workers going down there in the natural, in that run by. This uh, fourth base also getting scouted here. Handful of lanes just doing a lot of damage here. Dream gonna stim and chase these lanes down. These lanes will eventually get cleaned up. A couple lanes trying to hide there. They will get cleaned up as well. Solar deciding to stay home. So Overseer gonna chill out here in the dead space. Take a look at all these junk bots working away. And we have a main engagement coming in here. Uh, one thing Solar is really good at is taking out uh, mines before they go off. One thing Solar is not really good. Ooh, that mine actually does take out quite a bit, but that mine did do quite a bit of friendly fire there. Yeah, it took out one of uh, his own uh, Hellbats there. One thing Solar is not good at is dodging nukes. Sachersky, how's it going? Good to see you again. Another push coming in here from our Terran player. Terran gonna clean, uh, scan here and clear up a lot of this creep in the center of ground here. Those Marines there will get cleaned up, so it is gonna be Hydroling Bane. Uh, we are getting the Lurker upgrades, getting a couple Lurkers as well, so we are gonna go into that. Ooh, I like this here. These are just lanes. Good scouting lings here. Alright, gonna chase this little force back here. Again, that might take out more uh, Terran than anything else. These lings here unburl. That mine hit does get a few. But these lings are gonna get into the natural, into the mineral line here. Another mine hit there, taking out uh, a lot of the links. Three workers going down, gonna burrow here, forcing a scan out at home. Lurkers are out, lurkers gonna be used to deal with those mines up here. All the links down here eventually do get cleaned up. Yeah, 
11 Marines and one SCV being taken out by friendly fire. This is what base number six for solar. So he has taken every base now on his side of the map. Ghosts are coming out soon. Plus three, plus three infantry attack armors finish uh, about halfway done for our Terran player. Ooh, Lurkers, you're going to deny mining at this gold base. Snipe's going to come in, take out a few of these Lurkers. Going to drop a... Ooh, I don't know about that. All right, going to do... I don't know if you guys saw that. That was beautiful. He circled around the Lurker to... Uh, to make sure none of his bio units were clumped up. But 14 workers here going down. A lot of ghosts going down. GG gets called Solar finally getting one on the board. All right, first lings are out. Roach Warren coming on down. I think we know what we're going to see here. It's going to be that Roach Ravager push coming on in. Ling, uh, command center being built on the low ground. There's no reason for him not to. First Reaper about to pop here. Ooh. Blueberry flavored soju. All right, this Reaper looking for the links. Two of the links here will get spotted by that uh, SCV. That Reaper gonna intercept those links, but these links made a route like a a side route here. Uh, I would instead of going to the main base, just come down. Stitchy Twitch raiding with eighteen viewers. Stitchy Twitch, thank you very much for the raid. Welcome, welcome. Hope you had a good stream. Uh, this is uh, Brawlers Club number thirteen. We're in game number four of. Solar versus Dream. It is a best of five, and if I've not mentioned, it is our first uh, our first uh, series of the day. Samo Sidekick, thank you very much. I really appreciate that, buddy. All right, Roaches coming on in. Uh, high ground bunker being made. I believe we're going to see a tank coming out relatively soon. Command center has finished on the low ground. Ooh, that Reaper re uh, grenading itself. Kind of funny. Okay, so a Cyclone first coming out here. There is an Overlord here to provide high ground vision. One roach going down there to the... Uh, another roach going down there. One roach went down to the bunker. A second roach went down to uh, the cyclone. There's only one Ravager here. Oh, no. There goes the high ground vision. The Overlord is taken out. Behind this solar is droning. Hey, don't mention it. No worries. No worries at all. All right. This will all get cleaned up. And now we have a push going on to the other side of the map here. What does uh, Solar have to defend with? Solar literally has one Ravager and two Queens. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Six Roaches are about to pop, though. That Ravager going down. Roaches are out. One Queen going down here. Roaches are still in the process of coming out. One Roach going down there. Cyclone's just doing a number on these Roaches here. Another Roach going to go down there. Link's going to come in here, provide some buffer. That cocoon will get taken out before it gets morphed into a Ravager. These, oh my god, both queens now gone. 
Just Lynx coming out here. Four roaches about to pop. There we go. One roach popping there. That roach will get chased down and sniped. Queen coming from the high ground. Lynx coming from behind at the third base. And oh my god, that queen on move command. GG gets called Dream winning the 3 to 1.